Our bills are not checked this uh, forecast. Uh, the bad thing is that, that Thanksgiving, I'm sorry, I'm yeah. getting ahead of myself, Halloween. Well, uh, how, how would that happen? You already have all the stuff up at Lowe's and all the other stores yeah, exactly. where Christmas is already going. And, yeah. <laughs> we need some yeah. umbrellas. Uh, so which holiday weekend. do you want to talk about? Halloween. Halloween. And okay. the umbrellas we may need. <laughs> well, if your trick-or-treat community is, is Saturday, you might need the umbrella. If yeah. you're going on Sunday, you should be fine. Okay. So all right. Yeah, we've got that going. We'll talk about all this coming up here, and it's an, it's an interesting scenario. Kind of uh, meteorologically, it's fascinating. So, Max Track Live Doppler here at 618, waves of rain. And we're just going to see these green waves of rain continuing to rotate through from southeast to northwest, at least for now, because the low is sitting off to our west. A uh, heavier shower right now around Hazard, back to Hyde, and also around Salyersville, back to Prestonsburg. Light rain around Beattyville, Berea, Mount Vernon, Richmond getting some light rain too. Uh, you see it from West Liberty, they're going to to Moorhead, Flemingsburg, Owingsville in on some rain. Break right now in Mount Sterling. We're seeing some rain right now in Lexington, uh, back toward Paris and Georgetown. You folks there in Lawrenceburg have seen some rain. But a break right now in Nicholasville. From the Pepper Rick House in the Distillery District, it just rained. Looks like the rain may have let up here in the last couple of minutes, but it's still just wet and gray and chilly. If you have a home barometer, you go take a look at it because you're going to see it off if it's a, a regular aneroid barometer there. It's, it's going to be way over to the left. Uh, and with that, you are looking at one of the lower pressures that we'll find around here at any given time. So it's, it's interesting and it's still going to go lower. You won't need raincoats, looks like, for uh, costumes this year, at least if you're going on Halloween. Next week, we begin November, and the rush to Thanksgiving weather actually begins on Wednesday. We're going to talk about that. Rainfall likely again tomorrow going on into Saturday. It ends for us Sunday and Monday, and then rain chances come back again next week. Rainfall amounts around the bluegrass. This is just through tomorrow. For sales, a couple of tents. Paris may be a little bit better than a third of an inch. Lancaster, right around a quarter inch of rain. Uh, to the east, you've got an LEX 18 out of Owingsville. Pr Frenchburg has got about a quarter inch of rain. Campton, about three tenths. To the southeast, you're looking at rainfall totals in that same realm, maybe a little bit less. Hazard, only around a tenth of an inch. By the time you get to McKee, though, four tenths of an inch. And finally in the lakes, half inch out of Somerset, two tenths, though, in Liberty and Stanford. So it's just a big vertically stacked low. So not only at the surface, it's a loft as well. Sometimes lows will be more stretched out in the, in the vertical, but this one is stacked up, which means it's also slow moving. So we'll just keep this counterclockwise swirl here, which shows up beautifully on the future track. Just watch this. So you got your low sitting over here by Paducah. Everything just spins in that counterclockwise circle. Now tomorrow, a southeast wind, so we're a little milder. But by the time we get on into Saturday, that same counterclockwise swirl brings the air down out of the north and thus will be a couple of degrees cooler. 54 right now at the Bluegrass Airport. That barometer is actually 20 on 54. It's gone up a tick here in the last little bit. Temperatures 50s to around 60, although it was much warmer about two hours ago over in Hazard, it was 70. Well, we'll peak on Sunday in the low 60s. That cold is coming. Cloudy and damp, off and on light rain tonight, patches of fog, just your perfect fall night. 50 for that low temperature tomorrow. Gray and dreary, off and on rain. You might get a rumble of thunder. It'll be close to 60. Saturday, we knock it back a couple of degrees to the upper 50s. Halloween looks good on Sunday. Then the chill arrives. How about highs in the 40s next oh. week?